I don't know any student I've talked to that's gone on a study abroad situation that hasn't had it be a transformative learning experience for them. And I think it's because it's such an immersive experience. It's the opportunity to really engage deeply um, with a part of the world that you might not know very much about, with peoples, with the geography. Um, and so it's really impactful for the students who can do study abroad. Study abroad is important because there are, I, I think there are three main reasons. Reason one is help students to develop their academic and personal horizons. Secondly, study abroad will allow our student in a multicultural environment to develop some soft skills, how to interact uh, with people uh, from different backgrounds, different cultures, right, et cetera, et cetera. And then, um, so those are soft skills are highly sought by many employees, uh, employers, I should say. Um, and then also develop their global fluency. If you want to live, you want to work, in a global setting, you better have some basic understanding and ability to live in a global environment. Study abroad is a critical part of global learning. And uh, we strongly believe in study abroad. And in fact, uh, at the Hayworth College of Business, um, every student gets a $1,000 scholarship if they go on one of these short-term programs, and they get a $2,000 scholarship if they spend a semester abroad. And that kind of indicates the commitment we have for study abroad and why we feel study abroad is so critical in uh, a business Broncos experience at the Hayworth College of Business. Study abroad I see as a, a component of global learning. Um, usually one experience uh, could be you know, a, a, a week, it could be a, as, as much as a, a year studying abroad. Um, so again, I, I think it fits very well into what we, we're discussing in terms of global learning. But um, while it's very important and I think you can focus on one country or one culture or one, even one discipline within, say, engineering, um, I, I think it's, it's still just one component of many in terms of global learning within our campus. But the world is coming to us as well, um, even if we never leave um, our, our city, our state, or our country. Um, we're interacting with international people. We're dealing with the global economy and other um, aspects of the world that, that really um, need to have some understanding, um, or, or the students need to have some understanding of that um, as, they, as they think about how they're going to engage. Um, and to be successful in the world. Study abroad is obviously our go-to example for like that's a great example of global education but global learning is so much more than that. Again it's about perspective, it's about worldview, it's about trying to understand people, societies, cultures who are different from you and particularly when we think about the world that our students inhabit now and are going to inhabit, it's a globally integrated world. 